Hello my dear friends, in this video I am going to show you the dissection and display of floral parts and I am going to use the flower hibiscus. Flower is a modified shoot and it is the reproductive part of the plant. This flower is also called as China Rose and the scientific name of Hibiscus is Hibiscus Rosa Sinensis. So we could see this uh, green color part which is called as Calyx or Sepal. And we could see this Petals or Corolla. Now I am going to remove this petals one by one. And now we can see that staminal tube which holds all the stamens. Now I am going to take a dissection needle. And now I made a slit on a part of a staminal tube and I extended that slit to remove that staminal tube part to expose style. And slowly we can remove that staminal tube part. And with the help of dissection needle we can just take the style out. It is a slender tube, so we have to carefully take it out in order to separate a gynecium, that is female part. Now the stigma and the style have been separated from the staminal tube. Now let's remove the calyx part. And uh, the final portion of the female part of flower is ovary. The bulb-like ovary is taken out. And here we can see the pollen grains. See from the andrisium that is male part. We can see the pollen grains. Yellow powder. So this part, terminal part is called stigma and uh, later comes the slender tube that is style and the style attaches to a bulb like structure called ovary. Within ovary we have ovules. So if I take ovary and prick the ovary, I can see some bead like small structures. These are called as ovules. And coming to the display of the parts, this is Corolla. And uh, this Corolla is the one which uh, attracts the pollinators. And we can see calyx and the receptacle. And calyx is the one which protects the bud. And here we can see the female part of the flower gynecium. We can see stigma, terminal part. And the style, stigma connects to the style. Stigma is the place where pollen grains get attached. And uh, uh, after getting attached, the pollen grains will give rise to pollen tube, which will deliver the male gametes into the female gamete. And here we can see ovary. So within ovary, we have ovules and inside ovules, we have female gamete. And if we take cross section of ovary, see how clearly small bead like structures, these are called as ovules. And this is stamen, andrisium, the male part of the flower. And this is the uh, part which produces pollen grains. This is a single stamen 
showing anther and filament anther is attached with filament there are four walls in a flower they are calyx corolla andrisium and gynesium calyx and corolla are accessory walls andrisium and gynesium are essential walls for more such videos subscribe to let's get biologized channel thank you